Guess who's back in the house? It's Samantha here with Samantha Rest the Recipe and today we're making spicy tomato skillet eggs with prosciutto. I got this recipe from or Chrissy Teigen's Cravings Cookbook and um, so that's what we're doing today. But before I get into the recipe, if you're new to the channel, every Monday I take a recipe from a cookbook, a TV show, or an, inter an internet um, channel, or something on TikTok, and I test it out. I see whether it is worth the time it takes to make it and whether the taste is as good as the look. So if that's something you're interested in, please be sure to subscribe to the channel. If you are fam, friends to the channel, thank you so much for coming back. Welcome, welcome. And whether you're a friend, a family, sister, cousin, friend, friend, new, whatever the case may be, be sure that you are liking the video with a friend. So, so without further ado, here we are. So she did not say do this, but I'm going to spray this to fill it, right? Because eggs, you don't want to uh, stick to your cast iron. So that's what I'm doing. Now, ahead of time, y'all, she has a recipe for what she calls the perfect sauce. And so I did make the perfect sauce so that I would not have to bore you all with the process. It takes about, I don't know, 40 minutes, almost an hour to make. So I did that ahead of time. So to your cast iron, you're going to take four cups of this sauce. And the recipe in her book makes about six cups, right? So there it is i will say it's a nice chunky um tomato sauce and i did not taste it ahead of time past you know making sure that you know the seasoning was right and everything like that but i wasn't like just getting into it you know what i mean so that i could give the whole recipe and on my honest feedback and so we're going to put this in here and let it kind of come to a boil or like a simmer but she also said to Oh, excuse me. She also said to add a little red pepper uh, flakes. So I'm going to do that now. And I think this is a perfect, um, I put a lot, you know what I'm saying, spicy is what the recipe says. So <laughs> we're going to get it spicy. But um, I think this is perfect for brunch, right? I love tomatoes, so I'm not concerned about not liking the recipe. I'm just kind of trying to mix in those red pepper flakes and make sure it gets evenly distributed throughout and then once it kind of gets um what's the word bubbly okay once it starts bubbling then we're going to make a couple of wells drop our eggs in and let them get just set and put in some more of our um some more like the thyme oregano stuff like that bring that green amplify it get it looking good and then drop it in the prosciutto we can okay guys so we got a little simmer going on so i'm just gonna make our little wells to put our eggs in and you just kind of make a little you know a little deposit spot for them to sit down in okay so now dropping those eggs down in there that one i wish i had made a better hole y'all so just kind of make sure you're i'm gonna scooch it down you saw that hopefully that works oh you saw me i'm a magician yep that was good so yeah make sure you make a good enough um hole where your egg is gonna touch the skillet i feel Okay, so the eggs have been cooking about five minutes and so now I'm going to just come in and start tucking in some pieces of prosciutto all around. Just tearing off a little piece and kind of just sliding it in. I don't know what that little piece was I just put in there. And then we're gonna just let it cook a little bit more. Okay guys, so we're done. Now I will tell y'all, at first I wasn't, 
but I cheated with the eggs because some of them like got two done so the um like this guy right here I don't know if you can see him look right there Ooh, him right here two angles this guy here he did not he got like the the white got what is it? it it got white so you couldn't see the yolk no more so I just made a few over easy eggs and just kind of set them on there because you know the pictures they got to be aesthetically pleasing so that was my cheat I wasn't gonna tell you but now you know and so I'm gonna just taste it now I don't really be getting drunk no more I feel like this would be a good hangover meal as well so if you out there living your whole best life then you know this might do you good so I'm gonna give me a little bit of the sauce on here and a little piece of prosciutto while I'm holding this like this, it's shoveling. That's what I'm doing. I'm shoveling it. Now, I also am not really, I swear, <laughs> I'm telling y'all, I eat like a child. So, I don't really love over easy eggs that much. I'm going to just slide that to the side. But, supposedly, supposedly, the, uh, the runniness of the egg, dog. I can't think today, I can't talk today. Supposedly, the uh, the runniness of the egg, like all of this all together is, is gonna get me where I need to be. So I'm just gonna, I'm so scared, but here we go, here we go. The pictures look so pretty. Mmm, 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 mm. I'm mad. <laughs> Okay, um, mm. this ain't my jam. Yeah, um, the tomato sauce, it's tomatoey for me. I mean, and that's no shade to tomato, right? I like tomato spitting. I really like to <laughs> I really do like tomatoes. Um child, that's gonna give me heartburn. That's how much tomato I feel. I mean it's it's beautiful, super pretty. Not my jam, y'all. Mmm. No, this is not my thing. However, this bread I got from H-E-B. This is rosemary sourdough uh, multigrain bread. Listen here, mm-hmm. I swear, H-E-B can't do no wrong for me. I need them to sponsor me because I be shouting them out. I swear every other video here, everything is better, right? As a method, raise the recipe, uh. And at HGB, uh, here, everything's better. What? Here, everything's better. My chair is sliding to the right. It's sliding me to the right. Let's get to the right, okay? Here we go. Um, mm. I feel bad. And it's in my teeth. One. But let me tell you, it's just, it's too much tomato. So, I, I like it. <laughs> I, I feel I look my energy went doo doo doo. Um I rate this recipe for taste. I give it a one, honestly, because I just I can't get with the tomato sauce or, or whatever it is. Mm -mm. It's not for me. It's not for me. I don't know if whether it's a recipe thing or whether it's just a Samantha taste bud thing, because it could totally be a Samantha taste buds thing. So I'll have somebody else taste it and put it in the comments below what like folks in my household thought about it but man it's beautiful i still think it would be a great hangover dish or um for brunch with the family which is actually what she um said in the book she usually prepares this for a quick brunch or whatever i do like it however with less of the sauce so if you can scoop you up an egg and just a little teensy teensy tiny little bit of the sauce with a piece of prosciutto chef's kiss then it then I would take it up to even a three right but for me as a whole one for the taste for the time and the effort this is actually once you have the sauce prepared it is a, a very fast dish to make 
but because you have to make the sauce i'm gonna give it um a two for the time um and the effort and i don't because i did i wasn't a huge fan of the dish i just don't i don't see taking the effort to make the sauce and do the things and remember i told y'all i had to cheat and put the eggs on here so that they would be cute because i had overcooked the other eggs so i mean hmm, one for the taste for me two for the time and the effort will i be making this again nah but am i going to eat the rest of this i'll tell you what i'm going to do i'm going to scooch these eggs up put them on that uh toast with a little of uh, the prosciutto and a little drop of the sauce for the tomatoes and that's gonna be that for me okay so if you have enjoyed this video i really hope you have please make sure that you're liking and subscribing sharing it with your friends um and we'll see y'all next monday catch y'all later